Mic check, mic check, mic. Okay, okay. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome, Welcome back to our uh, first live of this, this month. month. Ano? Uh, July 2021. Ayun. Okay, okay shout out, out sa mga, mga dito, no? no? Okay, okay shout out sa mga, mga dito. dito. Okay. okay. Um, Bakit dalawa yun? Okay. Mic. Okay, ayan. Okay. So, okay ba? Okay ba yung audio, guys? Okay ba yung audio? Uh, reduce natin yung music, no? Okay, reduce natin yung music. Okay. So, don't forget to, ano, guys? Don't forget to follow, no? Ah, hindi pala to page. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe and also uh, click that notification uh, bell, no? And uh, para, ano, para updated ka lahat, no? Sa ating... Uh, Live market update, okay? Ayun, ayun. Um, lakas ba yung iko? Okay, chico, chico. Okay na, ayun. Mm -hmm. Chico yung ano, chico yung uh, audio. Oh, before tayo mag-start, no? Chico natin yung audio. Uh, audio, okay. Ayan, ayan. Mic check, mic check. Ayun. So, dalawa, dalawa kasi yung mic ko, no? Okay, yan. So, I think okay na. So, welcome everyone. Welcome. Uh, dito si Sir Ryan Honio. And si uh, Sir Sajin uh, Lau. Okay, welcome. And um, don't forget to subscribe, guys, no? And also, uh, click that notification bell. And also, like na lang. Okay? And also, ano, pag meron kayong mga kakilala... Uh, I just invite them uh, para at least no uh, updated sila sa ating uh, mga technical analysis using Elliot Wave, okay? So ayun ayun, okay? Thank you, thank you. And um uh, shout out pala sa mga community members natin sa Discord channel. Okay, shout out sa inyo sir and then um uh, good evening din. Okay, and hopefully uh, makapagbigay tayo ng magandang uh, technical analysis for tonight okay if you have your chart related request just comment it down okay para mabigyan natin ng analysis okay andito si sir Ju uh, good boy okay welcome sir welcome sa ating live and maganda yung signal natin oh. okay so far si vet lang um, okay naman yung profit taking natin kay vet pero hindi pa masyado nag break out no? and then yung AGLD nako maganda yun AGLD store G ETC CTC hindi pa masyado nag-break pero okay na, okay kasi nag-break na siya sa ano natin eh, yung entry price natin no. Oh. And ano pa? Um yung vet na lang talaga, wala pa. And si Dog, okay tingnan natin si Dog din kasi meron tayong signal for Dog. Sa ngayon wala pa, uh, rejected pa sa bear trend. Paglalag pa sa John, uh, doon sa ano sa bear trend natin and probably we could have uh, a very impulsive no on the upside, okay? Ayan, ayan. So, um, okay. So, before that, no, um, welcome na natin lahat na nanonood ngayon. Okay, welcome. Okay, ayan. Welcome, welcome sa lahat. Welcome. Okay, okay. Okay, ayan. So, um, without much ado, no, uh, direct agad tayo sa ating uh, chart, okay, para uh, marami tayong madiscuss ngayong gabi, Okay. Before uh, before tayo mag-start sa other altcoins, we will discuss uh, sa mga ano sa mga major altcoins and especially si ano si BTC yung una no na gagawa natin ng technical analysis. And then um, yun, maganda yung trade natin so far. So we will discuss also uh, what are those uh, potential coins na kailangan natin na tingnan no? especially si BZRX. Okay? We will discuss also yung mga altcoins na andun sa ating watch list, okay? So let's go, let's go. So take note no para at least sa uh, meron din kayong idea kung sa saan tayo mag-entry. Okay? So ngayon first in line, I have this uh, BZRX, okay? Take note. BZRX, okay? This is very ano, very good market, bakit? Kasi ano to, na launch to last year September. And then very ano siya eh maganda talaga yung market niya no. Uh, napaka-obvious no, napaka-obvious yung ginawa niya. Right? Okay? 
So the drop here, medyo maganda kasi we are uh, near on the breakout area. Okay, take note na. We are very near on the breakout area. So if you have your chart there, just draw a trend line. Okay, beer trend line. I-draw nyo lang. Pag the, yung price will go up there or it will move above. So probably that will be a major uh, reversal. Kasi maganda yung uh, ginawa niya dito eh. Last drop is around 6185. Okay, ito yung uh, last drop niya. 6185. And if you are going to have a trend line naman sa sa ilalim no and that would be parang naggumagawa siya ng something ano eh something diagonal in form okay the invalidation of this pattern is that if the price will break uh, this lower uh, trend that would be very bearish market no it will it will have a downside na mangyari so i want to see BZRX moving above this uh, bear trend kasi nakita natin rejected siya until now oh, ayun no oh. uh, merong rejection on that particular bear trend okay uh, there's a lot of sell uh, selling pressure on that area so tingnan natin mamaya if the price will go up there and then uh, probably we could have an entry okay pwede natin yan pasukin no? for our indicator we are still here above no tingnan natin if uh, magkaroon pa siya ng swing bago siya babagsak kasi our target would be around this area or ever near on that area no kasi um, we have a 1 2 3, 4, and probably, uh, probably 5 here bago siya tutul uh, tuluyang bumagsak. Okay? That will be a market cycle for BZRX, right? Okay? So, yan lang. Pasilip lang. Okay? For BZRX. So, let's go for our uh, BTC analysis. Okay? So, for BTC analysis, guys, um, okay, na-discuss natin to kanina. I posted this on the Discord channel, the update. Kanina kasi um, hinintay natin yung uh, yung uh, opportunity of uh, buying here. It is actually a good uh, opportunity to buy this retest area. Right? Pero uh, meron siyang week here. Okay? Hindi siya tumuloy as what I have uh, as what we have planned no kanina. Hindi siya tumuloy dito. So biglang uh, nag-break agad siya dito. Right there. Okay? Nag-break out siya. And then Good thing for BTC, okay? Good news kay BTC. Ano ba yung good news natin dyan? Right? Okay? Punta tayo sa ating uh, daily... Uh, ito, okay? Uh, daily time frame. Okay? Kaka-break lang ng ating beer trend. Yun, no? ba diba? Kaka-break lang ating beer trend. So, tingnan natin if it will reclaim above, especially pag... Uh, Uh, kukuha tayo ng uh, EMA 200 ito itong yellow line that is an R EMA 200 so if the price will go up there probably we could see a very potential uh, uptrend for uh, BTC okay right now okay we have r still red no red pa rin yung uh, uh, ano uh, uh, itong uh, EMA natin ito uh, red pa rin yan so I want to see a uh, green okay green lang kailangan na uh, it just like this no kunting green lang sa para makapag uh, proceed tayo on the upside no or probably retest on this 200 kasi below pa uh, below pa tayo diyan since ano to eh since uh, May no May 19 okay since May 19 uh, ilan na ba yung days ng uh, below tayo ng EMA 200 ano na mga 46 days no uh, one month uh, more than one month no uh, one and a half month ano na yung uh, sideways siya dito right so ayon Uh, meron lang sign okay this is very good news sa uh, uh, kay BTC okay it should hold uh, above this uh, beer trend natin kasi every time na may beer uh, I mean break out of the beer trend probably we could see a very potential movement of upside okay and then we might see a retest and then probably it will have a continuation on the upside okay daily natin still bullish pa naman Okay, I am seeing at the sun, oh, tinitingnan ko yung 4 hours dito kasi currently we are retesting, no? Currently, currently we are retesting this uh, itong uh, ano natin, uh, beer trend, no? Uh, retesting tayo dyan. And sa 4 hours time frame, and uh, if the price will go up, okay, especially pag above EMA 200 siya ng ating ating 4 uh, hours time frame, probably we could see uh, a movement on the upside, no? So sa lower time frame din natin, na base ating count no. Okay, ito na yung current uh, current retesting niya ngayon for uh, for this uh, market no. Okay, adjust natin to. Ayan para mas maganda. 
Ayan. The more touches, the better. Right? Okay. The more touches, the better. So, ngayon, um, maganda kasi dito, we are above na eh, ng ating beer trend eh. Uh, adjust natin konti. Ayan. Para mas wak, no? Ayan. Okay. Dito din, adjust natin para makita talaga natin yung reaction ng price, no? Okay. Ma makita yung reaction ng price para at least swak na swak. Ayun. Okay. So, um, So, for uh, this one, okay, major break of the beer trend. Okay, we are above, right? So, sa so 1-hour time frame, tingnan natin. So, by the way, guys, na-discuss natin to before kay BTC, no? Na probably we could have a retracement. Uh, sinabi ko sa mga, uh, yung previous live natin, that was uh, July. I mean, uh, June pala, June. <laughs> okay, last week ng June. Okay, sinabi natin na if you want long position, okay, wait nyo yung... Uh, retracement At ito na yung retracement na sinasabi natin no? So ngayon For this market I want to see a retracement Ito yung magandang retracement niya Right? Okay, this is the we uh, the best uh, uh, retracement na inabangan ko for this market Right? Um, bakit? Kasi ano to eh We have that support area Andyan din yung ating 3825 Okay, ano ba yung inabangan natin? Okay, ano ba yung inabangan? So based on my opinion Okay, opinion ko lang ha. Uh, this is very impulsive. Okay, maganda kasi yung market ngayon eh. Nakita natin yung movement unlike before. Na wala tayong mga impulsive move, right? This is impulsive, ito. Very impulsive 'yan, right? And then ito naman, very impulsive din yung ginawa niya. So, what will happen for BTC ito? So, if if you want a long position, this is the best time na makita natin yung market, no? Um uh, Okay, the 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 price that I I'll be I'll be looking at the 382 and the the ano the 2365. Right? Okay. So, what will happen? Ito 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 yung maganda. These are bear trend, right? Okay, ito yung bear trend natin. So, we are above of the bear trend sa daily. Na discuss ato kanina, no? And uh, these are bear trend and we are now currently above of that bear trend. Okay? And then And um, if we we'll try to count that one for our sub wave, no, we have, uh, we have a one here, two, okay, three, four, and a five, right? So what I mean is that this is very uh, uh, obvious, no, kasi uh, nakita naman natin na very impulsive siya. Meron siyang current mini wave or tinatawag niya sub wave, no, ito. Okay, this is our uh, maliliit na mga wave. Ayan. Okay, so zoom natin para mas clear, no? So if you try to zoom that one, right? So nakita natin, um, we have that wave one here. The macro, okay? So a mini, a mini macro lang, okay? Kasi malit lang yung uh, uh, time frame na ginamit natin. Okay, uh, one, we have a one here. Three, four, and a five there. Right? Okay, five wave move. One, two, three. 4 and a 5 there 1, 2, 3, 4 and a 5 right? Okay, very impulsive kasi nakita natin yung wave 3 na nagkaroon siya ng 5 internal wave right? Okay, very very obvious yung ginawa niya so ngayon we are now re uh, retesting na naman the support area so when it comes to support area sa so wave 4 we are targeting these levels Okay, we are targeting that levels. We are uh, we have the one more pump or one more leg up, so market. Ito na yung one more leg up natin, right? One more leg up, para makapagcreate tayo ng magandang swing sa taas. Okay? Lagyan natin to ng micro yan. So this will be our targets max uh, maximum mga ito that would be around thirty eight. Okay, probably thirty eight thousand. Yung possibility niya. Okay. Pwede din na hindi tayo aabot dyan or baka mag-create yung truncation. Okay, pwede mag-truncated yung ating, ano eh, ating uh, uh, diagonal in form eh. ba diba? Pwede natin yan. Ito naman, this is very impulsive also. Okay, impulsive din to. One, two, right? Three, four, and five. Inside, uh, I mean, the internal wave, one, two, three, four, and five. Right? So, isa din niyang very impulsive no if we try natin yung account okay uh, if we try to count that one uh, one 
2, 3, 4, and 5. Right? Okay, lagyan natin ng sub, sub macro. Ayan. Diba? And then, inside of that wave, meron tayong 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Right? Okay, meron tayong ganyan. Okay. So, the concept is that, meron tayong 5 wave move dito. Major break of the trend Yan yung magiging confirmation natin for the correction Right there So ngayon Ano yung nangyari Sa market ni uh, Ano ni BTC During this area Okay So the possibility is that We might retest around uh, 34 Or 35 Okay 35 Ayan 35 First is 35 And then Mga 34 level 34,600 Or 34,700 Okay Yan yung mga levels Okay Lagyan natin ng price no Para at least makita nyo Price level Ayan no Ayan yung uh, mga level na possible Na i-retest ni BTC Yan tatlo na yan Okay 35,300 Yan yung current price niya ngayon Di ba? Na-retest niya ngayon uh, 0.146 Next will be uh, 0 0.236 Okay, kasi meron din support dito so, 0 0.236, pwede din papasok dyan Okay So, we need to see a clear pattern no? It might create another triangle po, For tomorrow no? Okay, kasi we've seen a lot of triangles uh, Sa ating ano, eh, sa ating mga altcoins So, probably yan din yung gagawin ni BTC Mag sideways siya muna dito Sideways Bago siya mag-create ng uptrend na naman okay? Kaya abang-abang tayo dito For uh, uh, BTC So yan yung uh, nakikita natin Okay, invalidation Okay, invalidation Okay, if the price will break uh, this trend line natin Probably invalid yung bullish scenario ni BTC If it will break This one Kasi alam naman natin we are above of the bear trend Okay, above bear trend Kasi ito yung bear trend resistance natin eh Ito Itong trend natin yan, yan Yan yung bear trend resistance natin So we are above of that Okay So We could retest previous uh, Supports I mean resistance na naging support Ito yung area 3 to is the best uh, uh, Waiting area Okay pwede natin yung pasukin If bibigyan tayo Na opportunity Probably Pwede siya sa ano lang Pwede siya sa 2365 lang Okay, so we need to clear uh, to see a clear uh, uh, pullback no before entering markets like this, right? Okay, so kaya if you are planning to have a long position, ako dito pag pag meron akong long position halimbawa, hindi to ibibigay ng market. If the price will break another previous high ito, if market will create another previous high, probably shallow na yung wave for natin, right? Okay, halimbawa, the price will break again. Diyan ako papasok Okay So yan yung ano Yan yung uh, Low risk Yan low risk Okay Kasi every time na mag break out talaga siya Meron siyang kasunod na Uptrend Okay Yan yung pattern eh Usually Pag uh, meron continuation pattern Break the previous high And then we could use uh, Below no Below of the breakout area Yan yung magiging stop loss natin Right Break out And then below the Stop loss below the trend line Or the breakout area ng market right okay ito so maganda to and uh, take note no uh, we are still uh, struggling upside and mag the good thing for BTC kasi lumabas na siya sa bear trend this is the very good news okay and altcoins natin tum uh, ano meron na mga altcoins na nagsiliparan especially si Alice okay so tingnan na din natin si Alice mamaya no I, uh, ano ba yung mga status uh, makikita, makikita natin for Alice right okay so, yan yung for 1 hour time frame We are waiting for a continuation Okay uh, Probably ito yung waiting area natin for retracement 3850, 2365 And ito yung mga uh, consecutive uh, price no? Prices, 467, uh, 46 or 4, 4, 347, 35 or 3533 Right? So, we will just wait for another attempt no? To break that another previous side Kasi target natin dito is around here Yan yung target sa to complete the cycle okay the the uh, contracting diagonal okay 
So to complete pag makumplito to, nako maganda to kasi the next move particularly pag mahit itong target natin, it will retrace again. So yan na yung start ng ating another swing sa taas. Medyo malakas tong next move ni BTC. Okay? Kaya abang-abang tayo for this one, okay? So um abang-abang lang sa ating ano Discord channel kasi we are giving uh I ami mean, nag-start na tayo ng magbibigay ng VIP signals. Okay? Uh, kasi uh, na-stop natin 'yon before, no? Okay? Ngayon, ibalik natin. Okay? Para happy-happy lahat. Okay, so yan, yan yung ating uh, analysis for BTC um, levels to watch, no? Ito yung levels to watch natin. It should not touch around 3 4 300 Okay, it should not touch there. Okay, or even break that trend line natin. So, it should hold this area. Okay, para yung continuation partner natin will also continue, no? Uh, halimbawa, we have this trend line. Okay, yan yung possible din. Ang gulo, no? Daming trend line, okay? <laughs> so, yan yung levels na inabangan natin. Um, break the previous high. We will entry long here. Right? In case, no? Magkaroon siya ng other continuation there. And then, if not, it will continue downside. Probably, will retest this area. Or, it will retest again this area. This is where our support area for the wave 3. So, pag mangyari yan, so it will have a continuation again. Okay, for uh, for the uptrend. So, the good thing is this. Um, tomorrow will be uh, the, the closing candlestick for the weekly time frame and the opening as well. Okay? And then the good uh, the good thing for the market ngayon, kahit weekend daw no, nakita natin kahit weekend pero maraming breakout. That is one of the sign okay na pabalik na yung sigla ng market, di ba? For how many weeks? Okay, uh, at least uh, mga 5 weeks siguro. Okay, every time na weekend laging duguan yung market. Okay? Ngayon, this is the first week. Okay, this is the first weekend na green yung market, right? Okay, napansin nyo? If you want to check naman yung previous, no? Uh, last Sunday, nakita natin yung red market. Pero ngayong Sunday, nakita natin yung green market. Alright? May, may iba, nag-red. Especially pag nag-correct na sila. Okay? And then, most of the altcoins, okay? They are green. Okay? Especially si, ano, si Alice. Grabe si Alice. So, yan... We'll see another uh, round of uptrend if the price of BTC will hold this area. Okay, punta tayo sa BTC dominance. Okay, for BTC dominance naman, or the BTCD, okay, we are still currently downside. Okay? So, take note of this. The price should at least, no, uh, continue uh, the uptrend or else, baka maabutan tayo itong ating uh, BTC dominance Okay, kasi I am expecting For a swing Yung swing niya dito nakuha natin Okay, na-post ko to sa Discord Okay Na-post ko to sa Discord uh, Break area Okay, saan ba yun? Na-post ko to sa Discord eh Yung BTC dominance Okay, tingnan natin sa Sa Discord Kaya pag wala pa kayo sa Discord guys, no? Kindly join us Okay, para updated kayo sa ating um, analysis Okay So meron ako dito Na-share ko to sa ano eh I think sa mga VIP natin Or the Mga Elite Wave graduates no Okay uh, Elite Wave graduates Saan ba yun? Mm -hmm. Saan ba yun? Uh, BTC Dominance Okay meron ako na-post dito sa ano eh BTC Dominance BTC dominance is the pumping. Ayan. Atom. Okay. Check ko muna guys ha. Yung uh, BTC dominance. BTC dominance. Hindi ko nakita no. Okay. BTC dominance. BTC dominance. Okay. Wait muna guys ha. Check natin yung uh, BTC dominance. At para meron ka idea no. Uh, BTC dominance. CTC update. Okay, BTC Dominance mm -hmm. Okay, di ko makita Okay, so uh, later on na lang no? Later on na lang Okay, so 
Um, itong wave 4 natin, these are wave 4, okay? Ito yung wave 4 natin, and we are attempting for the wave 5 sa ating BTC dominance, okay? This is the good news for the Elliot wave kasi we can use Elliot wave on the BTC uh, dominance market, no? Or the prices, the movement of the price. So, for this market kay, ano, kay BTC dominance, okay, it should at least, no? It should at least, uh, uh, we'll have um, one more drop sa market. Okay, tingnan natin sa 4 hours time frame if Okay, pababa, pabagsak ko man yung ano, 4 hours natin, no? pabagsak pa So, mayro pang chance na yung mga altcoins natin ay lilipad Okay Daily time frame, pabagsak din Ito, maganda to So, uh, mayro pang chance talaga na may one more pump pa yung uh, altcoins natin, right? Okay, kasi pabagsak pa to And then, uh, the bad thing for this market Is that if it will attempt again Okay? Or it will continue upside kasi I am expecting for a swing. Right? Yung swing kasi naabangan ko dito for the BTC dominance. Okay? Around, ano to eh? Mga 6185. Okay, delete natin to, Delete natin. Okay, delete natin to, Mga around this area. Ayan. Right there. Okay, yan yung attempt, no? So, kaya... Kailangan BTC will have uh, another uptrend no uh, sa ano sa ating uh, uh, market ngayon tomorrow. Okay, kailangan i-hit niya muna yung ating targets. Baka kasi mas short tayo dito, right? If itong BTC dominance will attempt to have a swing kasi I'm expecting for an ABC here. Okay, probably duguan naman yung market, right? Kaya yung ating uh, BTC dominance it could have one more drop here for the wave 5. Kasi ano to eh? 1, 2, 3, 4, and a 5. Right? And pagkatapos ng 5-wave move, it will attempt to have another swing for the 3-wave move para sa ating targets. Okay? It could have one more drop. Pwede. Okay? Pwede siya mag-create ng one more drop. Kaya abang-abang tayo for the BTC. Pagkatapos ng retracement ni BTC natin, we'll see if mag-create pa another uh, breakout na naman. Kasi maganda if mag-breakdown to si ano natin eh si dominance para tutuloy yung mga alts okay especially si ano si BZRX or other altcoins it should continue downside here for our wave 5 okay para at least no maganda yung ating uh, position sa ating mga altcoins especially yung mga signal natin si dogcoin okay dogcoin natin so pag ito bumagsak probably uh, baka mag breakout na talaga si dogcoin for the bear trend no kasi we are facing the bear trend for dogcoin kaso lang bumagsak or nag-correct si BTC or nag-start na ng correction no? so we'll see no tingnan natin we are currently holding this uh, support area no ito, ito din yung inaabangan ko for my positions additional positions sa mga altcoins na watchlist ko ngayon okay if the price will I mean the, the BTC dominance will attempt to go below okay of this uh, uh, support level niya ngayon kasi meron tayong support area dito eh. ito yung nagiging support area for the uh, dominance no okay so yan yung ano yan yung uh, behavior of this dominance natin so probably if a break niya yan probably we could have another uptrend sa mga altcoins natin okay we'll we'll ano we will uh, check the altcoins if ano yung mga potentials right so don't forget to comment down your request guys no okay sa mga nanonood ngayon okay don't forget to comment down your request para mabigyan natin ng analysis. Okay? So, yan yung ating analysis for BTC and also the BTC uh, dominance. Okay? Waiting pa rin tayo until now for this, ano natin, waiting area. Okay? So, waiting area tayo dyan. Right? Okay? So, abang-abang tayo dito. So, an another thing is yung ating uh, mga signal. Dogcoin Okay, dogcoin natin We have a signal here Okay, abang-abang kayo sa mga Naka-attend ano naka -attend ngayon Okay, just draw a beer trend no? Okay, uh, all you have to do Is to draw a beer trend Yan, Very simple lang, very simple Ayan. Okay, ito yung beer trend kay dog Okay, beer trend, right? Okay, exactly at the 2365 Kasi inabang ko dito Around 382 pa lang dapat eh Okay, 3 lang dapat Pero nag-hold naman yung uh, 2, 3, 6, 5 natin Ito 
nag-hold pa naman siya so probably uh, maganda din yung ano yung uh, pullback area nito okay for the uh, dog coin okay so for dog coin naman very explosive to kaya abang-abang kayo okay take note ha abang-abang talaga kay dito kasi anytime pwede to mag breakout eh beer, beer trend to beer trend and usual sa mga market pag isang beer trend okay it will create a massive breakout talaga okay kaya abang-abang kay dito tingnan nyo guys oh ayan oh may, may mga mga reaction yung market dyan kaya pag yan mabasag nako reversal and hindi naman siya resumption ng ating uh, beer trend okay I mean the, the uptrend no? just a swing okay swing lang uh, market cycle lang yung gagawin niya right so abang abang kayo dito so I'm still waiting for this to break kanina kasi ano to eh nag signal ako Uh, sinabi ko doon it should close above okay, the candlestick especially sa 1 hour time frame ayun o oh, wala pang close right meron siyang pump konti kaso lang hindi siya nag close above I want to see candlestick closing above sa ating bear trend okay for dog coin and probably we could see another uh, potential breakout no so the bad thing naman okay or the bearish scenario for dog coin If i-break niya tong ating uh, trend line dito, probably medyo malalim din yung babagsakan niya, di ba? Kasi yung support natin dito is around this area. Okay, meron din tayo dito. Medyo malalim kasi wala nang sumasalo kay dog coin ngayon eh. Okay, meron tayo dito, mga week. Okay? So kaya uh, if I were you know, if you want a position for dog, wait niyo lang to ma-break. Okay, just draw a trend line or a bear trend. And you can monitor the the reaction sa market ngayon, right? Okay. So yun yun yung status ngayon for sa ating market, no? Okay. So yun. So tignan natin mamaya for dog coin. So ngayon we have we have a request here. Ayun, no? Meron tayong request si ano? Um. Resty Gilaran, okay? So, shout out sa you, Sir Resty. Okay, welcome sa ating uh, live, no? Okay? Alpa, okay? Tingnan natin sa Alpa. And also, T-Fuel. Okay? Uh, uh, first is Al Alpha. Number 2, XMR by Sajin uh, Sahin Lau. Okay? And then, number 3 is Ada. Requested by Sir Ryan. Uh, who knew? And also, uh, We have T Fuel, okay. So guys, don't forget to click that subscribe button, no, and then click the notification bell para updated kayo once na mag live market update tayo, okay? Ayan and abang abang kay guys, kasi I am planning to post mga ano mga techniques, no, sa mga Elliot Wave, okay? mga 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 ganda ng tips, no, okay soon. Okay, um, sa ngayon busy pa tayo, may medyo ano, medyo um, loaded tayo sa schedule, okay? So, wait ta natin si Dogcoin once again. Ay once again, guys, Dogcoin near sa breakout area, right? Kasi maganda yung opportunity. Do not miss the opportunity for Dogcoin, right? Abang abang tayo diyan mamaya. So, ngayon, let's take a look at the uh, market for Alpha. Okay, as requested by Sir Resty Uh, gilaran okay so punta tayo kay Alpha 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 A A A mm, I think walang Alpha algo lang okay tingnan natin si Alpha guys Alpha Alpha okay Alpha USDT Binance May, meron, meron nga no Alpha natin Alpha ayun no Okay, same daily time frame tayo titingin. Daily time frame. Ang grabe, ang ganda ng trend niya dito, guys, oh. Ang ganda, ang ganda. Grabe, ang ganda, no? Ah, uh, okay, wait natin. Mm -hmm. Okay, dito tayo. So, support and resistance ito. Ito maganda 'to. Okay? If nakita niyo ito, very basic, oh, very basic oh, support and resistance, oh. Okay, right? Right there. Support and resistance. Okay, and then bear trend. Okay, bear trend natin. Ayun, no? Kaka-break lang ng bear trend natin. Kaka-break lang. 
And we have another short term bear trend, short term bear trend. Okay, break na talaga siya, no? Break retest yung ginawa niyo. First attempt to break and then break retest right there. Okay? So um pagkatapos nito, we will count. We will start to count, no? We have uh 4 hours time frame, tingnan sa 4 hours time frame kung makakuha tayo. 4 hours time frame. Ang layo, no? Ang layo. Okay, wait natin, wait natin. Okay. Kasi may cycle to eh, yung cycle niya. Okay, zoom natin din. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Isa tong week, no? Isang week. Pero probably, pwede dito, eh, pwede dito sa, ano eh, pwede dito sa diagonal, no? Ito. Meron tayong diagonal in form there. Ayan. Okay, diagonal in form. Choppy markets. Kasi makikita natin yung volume. Ayun o, maliit lang yung volume na dito. Right? Okay, pwede natin yan sabihin na 1, 2, 5. Okay, uh, enable natin yung minor. Ayan. Minor wave. And then we have a macro here. Ayan. And then, um, okay. Meron tayong uh, something flat here. Right? Tingnan natin if uh, flat ba to or zigzag lang. Okay? Kasi meron tong ano, meron tong confirmation eh. Okay, 7 and 6. Zigzag lang to. Okay, hindi siya flat. Okay, zigzag lang. 5 wave, 5 wave, 5 wave, 3 wave. Okay, A, B, and a Z. ABC structure. Okay, pagkatapos, we'll, we'll check the levels, no? Attempt levels right there. Ayan. So, probably, pwede pala, ano to? Pwede to, ano eh? Pwede to uh, swing, no? Pwede to swing. Okay, tingnan natin. Tingnan natin, guys, no? Mm -hmm. Okay, focus muna tayo. Okay, focus. Okay, focus. Di ba? Okay, fo focus matay. Focus. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Kasi ano to eh. Meron siyang, uh, meron siyang ABC structure din dito. A. Okay. A, uh, B, and a C here. Right there. ABC. Okay. So, ABC. So ngayon, we have that bear trend, no? Uh, we, we are at the support area for the wave 3. Okay? So sa Elliott Wave Theory kasi, guys, no? Uh, merong mga ganyang senaryo na nagiging support yung wave 3 natin. Okay, sa mga, ano, sa mga bootcamp attendees natin, okay, this coming uh, uh, July 5, no? We will discuss that one. Ayun. <laughs> Okay, may, may sound effect na tayo. Para at least boring, no? <laughs> okay. So, ito yung targets natin, okay? For uh, Sir, ano, Sir Rusty Gilara, no? Ito yung target natin for the swing around there. Uh, probably, mag-create siya ng ABC structure. A, B, and a C. Okay, ABC structure. Pwede. Or even here, no? Ayan, no? Ang layo. Mga ganitong area na to. Okay. So we'll see, we'll see. Well, kasi ano to, ABC pa rin yung ginawa niya eh. ABC lang. Right? Okay? So um we are looking at the impulsive move ngayon for for alpha sa lower time frame kasi lower time frames yung uh, best na ano eh makita natin yung galaw ng market, right? Okay, for so for hours, I mean 1 hour time frame. Oh, the good thing, meron tayong volume. Okay, nakita niyo yung peak ng volume. Okay, ganda. Okay. <laughs> Ang ganda talaga ng volume, no? Grabe. Okay. Uh, for uh, this kind of market, okay, and uh, we'll just try to check the, ano eh, itong uh, trend line. Okay, trend line lang talaga yung uh, ating uh, magandang, ano eh, magandang, uh, ayan, no? It move within the channel. Channel na lang para mas maganda. Okay, channel. Ayan, parallel. 
Yan no? Ang ganda ng channel no? Diba? We in mo it moves in a channel Right? Okay uh, Major break Okay This is ano uh, Kung nakita nyo itong major break You can actually have an entry there Okay Yan yung may, uh, major break ng market ngayon Okay So our targets for ano for alpha is around this area oh. Okay, ito first target is uh, this ano uh, middle channel natin. Meron tayong uh, resistance na kabang diyan. Okay, this that is our resistance. Okay, this our bear trend no. Okay, uh, label natin bear trend. This our bear trend para at least makita niyo no. Bear trend. Ano ba 'yun? Okay, bear trend. Ayan, di ba? So, we have that bear trend here. So, ngayon, for alpha naman, if I were to trade this one, actually, ano to eh, uh, halos same siya ng reaction ng market ngayon eh. Halos same lang talaga, okay? Uh, we have that one here, two, three, four, and probably five, no? Uh, adjust natin yung, ano, ito, ito. Okay, Probably one, two. Uh, we have four here. Okay, adjust natin to yan. Four. And uh, probably we'll have a five here. Okay. So first target is around. Ito yung first target, middle channel. Probably it could have a continuation. Okay, and then we might see a rejection sa area na yan, right? And then bago siya tataas dito. Kasi uh, our targets for our channel is above there. Okay. Sa indicator naman natin, we are at a uh, meron tayong ret uh, retracement currently. 4 hours naman is still bullish pa sa 4 hours. Okay, ano ba yung next entry natin? Ito yung magandang ano, magandang uh, tanong, no? What will be our next entry? Kasi pag mag-entry ka ngayon, medyo malit na yung reward, no? We have the decreasing volume. Okay, may, may increasing volume siya dito sa short term. Okay, pero tingnan natin if meron pang peak volume mamaya, okay? So, 1 hour tayo titingin. Okay, para meron tayong entry. So, sa 1 hour natin, nakita natin yung choppiness ng market, right? Okay, the choppiness of the market. Okay. So, the choppiness of the market, we are facing this resistance na ngayon. This our resistance area. Okay. We have uh, rejected sa area na yan. Okay, I want to see a clear um, retracement, no? Okay. A clear retracement sa market. Wait, tingnan natin yung ano levels dito. Okay, we have 1 2 1 2 3. Okay, check natin yung levels, no? Levels ng 1 2 3 natin. Okay, this one right there. Ayun, maganda. Maganda tong ano. Okay, levels ng uh, targets natin for this area, no? Mhm, mm 1 2 1 2 right there. Ayan, no? Nasa 3 e na tayo. Kasi I'm expecting for ano to eh. I'm expecting for impulsive. 1, 2, okay, 3, 4. Probably ano to eh. Probably yung target natin dito is here. 4 and then possible 5. Possible ito yung 4 natin, no? Okay, ito yung uh, magiging scenario sa market ngayon eh. Okay. So, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3 pa lang to dito. So, probably ano pa to eh. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 Parang ganun, no? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 So, if we try to to, to measure that one Around 3, 8, 2 Ayun, maganda to Okay For, uh, for ano, for um, CRST, no? Okay, uh, bullish pa tayo sa 4 hours I want to see markets Kasi, nag-hold pa naman yung 3, 8, natin Maganda yung 3, 8, 2 Nakita natin 3, 2, 5, kasi ano to, eh? wave 3 yan, eh Oh, let me show you my count no para meron kayo idea. Uh, count muna tayo para maganda. Counting. Kasi it's about counting. It's about analyzing, no? Uh, the Elliott Wave Theory. 1, 2, 3, 4, and a 5. So, probably we could see a 5 here. Ayan. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Right? Okay, zoom natin para meron kayong, uh, para makita nyo talaga yung counting natin, no? For this market. Okay, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 
One more one more pump. Targets natin for the three. Okay, let me show you kung targets natin. Uh, from this area, from here, going there, that would be around, ayun oh. Mga zero, uh, 78650 or 618, around that area. Um, risk reward ratio wise, ano, 8%, much better. <laughs> 8% lang yung ano eh. Makukuha natin kay Alpha, no? but okay lang. Okay, and invalidation area is around breaking uh, breaking the trend line natin or the channel that would be very bearish no kay alpha kaya abang-abang kayo dito paano ba mag-entry dito coach okay paano ba so if you want to enter ano alpha no the price should go up above dito okay it's, the price should go up above kasi we are below of this uh, resistance ngayon no okay it keeps on uh, going up but rejected pa rin siya dito eh If we will extend that one, meron tayo makikita na mga resistance area. Right? Okay. So, meron tayo dito. Uh, sa left side, wala masyado, no? So, ito lang yung major. Right? Major. So, ngayon, if gusto nyo i-trade to, yung risk natin is around, ilan ba yung risk natin dito before uh, that one? Mga 3%. Okay, 3% risk reward nyo. I mean, ito yung risk nyo. Yung reward natin, if i-trade natin yan. Ngayon, 7%, okay? Mga 2 is to 1. Okay, 2 is to 1 to. Alright? Kasi risk mo 3%, but double yung reward mo. Okay? So, risk reward wise, kung gusto nyo pasukin talaga, kasi gusto ko kasi dito, guys, no? Break muna. Okay, break muna. Parang ano, parang sigurista style, ba? <laughs> okay, break muna bago, ano, bago trade, right? It should break right uh, itong ating uh, resistance area no ito. It should break at least. Diyan ako papasok for alpha. Right kasi pag ngayon ka papasok kasi retracement to. Okay. It could go down or even break that one. So stop loss okay lang kasi may may stop loss. Pag gusto nyo low risk and high reward. Okay, low risk and high reward kailangan movement above muna right? That is ano parang uh, isa din yan sa mga ano eh uh, risk reward talaga okay so sa akin hindi masyado to hindi masyado, masyado if mag ka dito no hindi masyado maganda break nyo muna break nyo muna okay so yan yun kay sir ano sir uh, Restino Gileran kasi at, at, until now uh, nakahold pa naman yung 3 natin this is a very good uh, opportunity for alpha to have a a break no okay uh, vision natin yung targets natin sa wave 3 Okay, probably ito nga, ito nga no. Ito talaga yung uh, target natin for the wave 3, maganda eh. Okay, uh, target of for wave 3. We'll put a box no para meron kay idea din, meron kayong uh, inaabangan no. Okay, targets natin is ito. Tatlo. Okay, tatlo yung target natin for alpha. First is here, there and there, okay? Lagyan natin ng price para meron kayong guide, no? Basta i-break niya muna to Kailangan i-break, no? Uh, break area. Uh, lagyan natin. Okay, breakout area. Right? So, targeting after breakout is around first is 2%, uh, 4%, and 5%. Right? Okay lang, di ba? Maganda yan. Pero kung ngayon ka mag-trade, stop loss, around 3% lang mo. Okay na yung 3% stop loss. Eh. Right? So, yun. Yan yung 4 alpha natin. No? Waiting pa rin tayo. Still, bullish pa naman to. Unless na magkaroon siya ng invalidation dito. Right? Invalidation is where pag mabreak niya itong cha channel line natin. Okay? Ang ganda ng channel line guys. Oh. Nakita nyo? Di ba? Ang ganda. <laughs> Uh, supported pa rin siya dito eh Same dito Hindi talaga siya lumagpas Nung no? nakita natin Gumapang siya dito eh Ngayon nakakatawa kay ano Kay, kay Alpha no? Gumapang talaga Hindi ayaw talaga lumagpas Parang ano eh Parang merong uh, Mainit na Ano dito Parang may mainit na kape <laughs> Ano ba yung kape coach? Okay <laughs> Kape Kape daw <laughs> Okay Ayaw nila dito kasi mainit Right? So yan, so we'll just wait no for the 
uh, reaction no? if it will break then pasok tayo so next okay next in line we have XMR. okay ba yun CRST okay ba yun okay okay ba yun na uh, entry na tayo sa breakout area pero kung gusto nyo tayo i-trade okay naman to i-trade pero stop loss yung talaga below no mga 3% yung price okay so next punta tayo kay XMR ayun XMR and then uh, kay sir ano sir Roy Roy okay welcome sir okay welcome sa ating live uh, request niya ay ano eh request niya SFP okay SFP ano ba yung SFP okay safe safe pal wallet di ba ayun grabe safe pal wallet <laughs> maganda yung safe pal wallet di ba okay so meron akong trade meron akong yan okay noon okay, noon sa ngayon wala pa but uh, tingnan natin if mak makahanap tayo ng magandang entry no So, punta tayo kayo kay XMR muna. XMR. Okay, XMR. Okay, add natin to as ano? Add natin si Alpha, no? Para meron tayong ano? Alpha. Kasi wala akong, wala akong list nito, eh. Ayun, naka-add na. Okay, Alpha added on our list. Okay, next, XMR. Yun, lakas, oh. Malakas, we are facing the resistance. Isang tingin lang guys, no? <laughs> Obvious naman, di ba? Obvious naman yung uh, resistance area niyan dito, eh. Ayan, no? Resistance area. Hirap siya dyan, eh. Mahirap talaga yung i-break niya yan. Pero, ano? Breakout area yan, no? Okay, breakout area. See, if the price will go up there, nako, maganda. And, um, the bad thing for, ano naman, kay XMR, no, is para nag-create siya ng triangle, no? ascending triangle, nako. Bearish, ano to, eh. Bearish ascending triangle to, eh. So, the confirmation for XMR para hindi ito magiging bearish, okay, kailangan i-break niya talaga ito mamaya, no? O tomorrow. Kailangan i-break niya muna yan, right? Okay, punta tayo sa higher time frames. Higher time frames, daily lang muna, daily. So, yun, no? Di ba? Three? And we have a four here, okay? Malalim, malalim yung four natin. Hindi ko kasi ito na-update eh. Tingnan natin, no? If uh, pasok pa rin. Hindi ito pasok eh. Okay, dito natin ito. Medyo matagal lang kasi itong ano eh. Yung ginawa ko kasi yung XMR, I think dito pa rin yung price, no? But we'll see, no? Delete natin ito. Delete natin. Okay, trend line wise. Check natin. Grabe, very choppy. Napaka, napaka shallow lang, no? 3. Pwede, di ba? 3. 4 and 5, right? Okay, cycle. End of the cycle na to. Kasi meron tayo na may nakitang ma malaking ano eh, malaking downside eh. Okay, previous market natin, XMR Monero. Lakas ng volume dito. Okay. Ayun, um, okay, okay. Ito yung last drop niya, no? Last drop ni XMR. Ayun, grabe. Ang lalim, no? Ang taas ng week. Imagine yung week niya, guys, no? Ayun, ano yan, eh? Grabe, 50%. <laughs> grabe ng week. Dami na dali nito, no? Yung mga panic selling. Okay, grabe. Mga panic sellers. Nako, nagpapanic na sila. Okay, um... Basic na basic is the bear trend, okay? So kailangan practice talaga no if if you want if you want to have uh, I mean if you if you want a reversal especially sa market if gusto niyo mag-reverse yung market. Okay, kailangan break niya muna tong bear trend, okay? Kasi bear market pa rin tayo ngayon eh. Short term bear market. Okay? So ito naman for XMR Okay. Hindi maganda yung hindi maganda yung market niya dito eh. Okay, um pwede, pwede, di ba? 0.5 swing. Ah, maganda, di ba? Swing, pwede. Ah, uh, swing natin is around flat corrections, pwede to, flat correction. Flat correction B, pwede flat Uh, what I mean is that uh, Meron tong swing para, uh, Maganda yung swing niya dito 
Ito yung swing area. There. Okay, swing. Okay, pwede siya 6185 oh. Ayan, pwede siya dyan. 6185 oh, Alright. And then, um... Okay, if gusto nyo i-trade to si XMR para sa swing, kasi ano pa to eh? Cycle lang talaga, no? Yung may mga ano eh, may mga market na nag-end na yung cycle, okay? Ended the wave 5. And then pagkatapos, uh, mag-create siya ng mga swings, okay? Si XMR natin, uh, based sa observation, observation, okay? Ano ba yun? <laughs> okay, uh, observation natin, no? Um, the price should break this one. Right? Kasi initially We could potentially see na ano to eh A B And a C Okay A, B, C yung structure na nakita natin dito Right? Okay minor Ito minor ba to? Yung minor din Diba? So A, B, C Right? Okay ano yung ibig kong sabihin? Okay ito maganda to Okay uh, Ang market kasi ni XMR Ay nag-create siya ng Itong downside considered to be A B and a C okay so target natin for XMR is around this area you know okay 0 0.5 6.18 or probably mas maganda talaga sa ano eh 6.18 to okay it, there could be a, a reaction sa 0 0.5 pero okay pag flat correction siya pwede dito pwede di ba something running flat no So, pwede 0.5 as a flat corrections. Pag zigzag naman, is around this area. 6786. Pwede nga dito aabot sa 784. Eh. Uh, 854, pwede. Okay, kung flat correction lang siya, andito lang siya sa level ng resistance. Okay, flat correction, that would be B. Okay, ayan. Okay. A, B, in which meron siyang 3 wave structure. A, B, and a C. Right? Okay, yan yung possible na mangyari sa, ano, eh, sa XMR. So, paano ba mag-entry dito for long position? Okay? Meron tayong mga short-term support. Ito naman yung short-term support natin, right? Okay, maganda yun, no? Ito. Ayan, short-term support, oh. Nakita nyo? Ayan. Di ba? Short-term support natin. Ito naman yung short-term resistance natin. Ayan. Okay. So, ngayon... My plan for this XMR para ma-trade natin yung swing. Okay, first is sa lower time frame, tingnan natin sa lower time frame. It should break at least the bear trend. Okay, that is the number one. Okay? Um adjust natin yung ano, adjust natin yung yung uh, bear trend yan, no? Kasi hindi masyado natamaan eh. Yung ating ayan, ayan. Ayan, no? Di ba? Parang ano, parang nag-blur. <laughs> okay. So ayan. Um, next will be the resistance. Ayan, resistance tayo. Okay. So, ngayon, meron tayong ABC. Okay, maganda kasi ito kasi ano ito eh. ABC structure A, B, and a C. Okay. Uh, ito yung uh, mini wave, I mean sub wave niya inside of that uh, particular wave, no? Uh, ayan, di ba? ABC structure. So ngayon, um, we are waiting for this major break Kasi if it will happen, the break niya yan Probably meron tayong, uh, meron tayong structure na A You know, parang ganun yung structure niya eh Right? Kailangan i-break niya muna tong multiple resistances And if you want a good reward Okay, remember, if gusto nyo good reward Let the market break Okay, let the market break Ayan yung confirmation natin no pag i-break niya yung XMR natin resistance and then dyan tayo papasok initially okay initially uh, we could um, consider that the market is moving a flat correction so I am waiting na ma-break niya mo to A, B, C pwede yan A, B, C natin yan right and then ito yung magiging 1, 2, 3, 4 and a 5 kasi we are expecting for a 5 wave move right okay kasi ano tayo we are, we are waiting for the B wave Okay So Ito na yung gusto ko makita Okay uh, Sa market Para at least makonfirm natin no? okay. Kailangan talaga mayroong confirmation Right Okay A, B, C Wave 2 Pwede Ayan These are B Okay B natin 
A, B, C. So, um, A, B, and then impulsive move sa C. Okay? Five-wave move. So, ngayon, okay, first is that we should at least no confirm the breakout first. Okay? Before natin to i-trade. Kasi pag i-trade natin ngayon na mag-long tayo, nako, uh, baka nga, nga magiging bearish scenario talaga to. Kasi, parang ano talaga siya, no? Um, considered to be an ascending triangle. If it happens na mag-create siya ng another drop here, nako, ascending triangle na yan. Mahirap yan, di ba? Okay, one, uh, A, B, C, D, A, B, C, D, E, and then probably next is breakdown na yan. Pag confirm triangle, right? Pag hindi naman confirm triangle, maganda dito, kailangan i-break niya muna. Okay, take note of this. Para kay eh, uh, Monero, no? Breakout area. Ayan. Okay, yan yung breakout area. Kaya abang-abang tayo dito. So, our target for the breakout area in case na i-break niya yan, kaya abang-abang kayo dito, I'll be also uh, watching this coin. Okay, and now and then, para matrade din natin kasi maganda yun din yung profit taking natin. Eh. Ayun o, no, resistance natin o, no, maganda o. Oh. Diba? 6185 o. Oh. 1.614, wave 4, and then one more leg up. Maganda talaga. Okay. <laughs> Aabot talaga tayo dito sa ating 6185 o, oh, diba? Pwede. Yung target natin o, oh, kasi we have the wave 4. Right? Probably pag mangyari yan, that would be around... Ano to eh, maganda yung breakout area. Reward natin dito is around, ayun no, 28%. Naku, maganda. Di ba? 28% lang. And then, pag breakout yan, mamaya, or tingnan natin tomorrow, uh, we, will, we will follow the trend, no? Itong trend natin. Ayan, okay. So, um, ito, pwede siya, bumagsak muna siya dito, pwede. Right there. And then, pag mag-bounce sa dyan, pwede natin yung trade, Right? Pwede siya dito uh, papasok kasi andito niyo yung uh, support area niya, short term support area for XMR. And then pagkatapos, we could see a potential breakout, okay? Kaya abang-abang kayo dito basta okay, only trade, okay, only trade for long positions or buying position during that breakout or break the trend line, right? So my characteristic yung market i eh, once the breakout siya, it might retest. Pwede, may maraming mga market na ganyan eh. And then, another attempt to break out. Okay? So, yan. Yan yung 4 XMR natin. So, hopefully, makuha natin yan. Add natin yan sa watch list. Okay? Watch list lang. So, yan. Yan yung 4 uh, sa ating ano, XMR, no? Ano yung update ni BTC ngayon? BTC. Okay? Nag-sideways pa yung BTC natin. And then, while our BTC uh, dominance natin nag-stable, ano, nag no? Nag-stable yung price niya. Grabe yung alis. Ang ganda ng alis, no? Okay, ang ganda ng alis. Okay, that's all for XMR, no? Balik tayo kay Alis. Ito yung continuation pa, oh. Ang ganda. Ang ganda, ganda. Ilan na yung, ano? Ilan na yung percentage dito? Percentage yung, ah, uh, chances ng up niya. Another 13%, no? Another 13%. Pwede yan, uh, 13%. So, ang daming breakout niya kanina eh. Okay, first is ito. Okay, ito yung first breakout niya. Second breakout. Ayun oh, grabe yung mga breakout niya. And then, probably meron tayo dito. So, if uh, mag-correct naman to si, uh, si Alice, no? Ganda talaga to ni Alice eh. Na-discuss ko to sa, ano, na-discuss ko to sa mga bootcamp attendees natin kanina eh. Um, if the price will retrace, Buying opportunity na yan. Okay, buying opportunity. Mag ang ganda ng volume. Ang ganda ng volume. Okay? So, if pagbigyan tayo ng market, ng uh, pattern, okay, kailangan. At least, no, triangle pattern. Sana. Okay? Sana bigyan tayo ng pattern. Uh, pattern lang, triangle, or even above this resistance, or above this uh, bear, kasi bear, ano to eh, bear, bear trend. Major bear trend to eh. Okay, ito yung bear trend natin. Ayan, oh. Ayan, ito yung bear trend. Major bear trend natin yan. So, if bigyan tayo ng uh, chance ni, ano, ni, uh, um, ni Alice, okay? Kung bigyan tayo ng triangle pattern dyan, okay, triangle pattern or sideways lang. Nako, maganda din yung taking profit natin, no? Kasi, uh, potential pump na dito is around another 20%. Okay, another 20% yung pump niya. So, it should create, no? Uh, sideways lang. 
Kasi pag ngayon ka pumasok, FOMO na talaga 'yan. Okay, FOMO na 'yan. Okay, I don't want to trade FOMO, no. Okay, mahirap 'yang FOMO na 'yan eh. <laughs> okay, kasi ano 'to, late na tayo masyado dito. Okay? It could continue. Okay, depende kasi 'yan sa risk management mo. Pwede mo siya i-buy sa spot, pwede, right? Pero pag future ka, um, pwede ka sa lower time frame papasok, right? And then uh, dapat secure mo yung stop loss nyo. Okay, baka alam naman natin yung market nung biglang ano, biglang retrace, no? Okay, so, yan. Punta tayo kay Ada. Nako, Ada. Grabe yung breakout niya kay Ada, no? Pero ano to, eh? Breakout. Ito yung kanina, no? Grabe. Grabe talaga yung trend niya, eh. Halos lahat ng market inside the channel. Okay. Flat correction to. Flat correction, no? Parang si Dash, no? Parang si Dash. Ayun no, retest. Ako yung ganda. Ganda ng retest niya tapos bumalik, di ba? Okay, ah, uh, mm, okay, meron tayong low dito. Okay, 1 2 3 4 and 5. Okay. Mhm. Mm so, ah, uh, <clears throat> okay. 1 hour natin. Okay, focus muna tayo. <laughs> Nako, nakaka-suspense to. No. Okay, check natin Okay, so yan mm, Okay So, if you want to enter ADA Okay, the structure kasi Ang ganda, ganda talaga yung structure niya eh Right? Mm, pare, halos pareho siya ni, ano, ni Dash Ano no? Hindi si Dash Si uh, XMR, right? XMR Halos same siya ni XMR I want to see markets 1 2 3 4 and 5. Okay, continue natin yung ano, yung uh, yung channel, channel ayan, channel. Okay, yung channel line. Di ba? <clears throat> so the channel line, okay, for our uh, market is possible talaga na kung gusto niyo pumasok dito, 1 to 3, 4 and 5 na kasi to eh. Retrace. Okay. Um, retracement na nabangan ko dito is around pwede to dito 6185 of uh, 0.5 pwede no okay check natin para at least makita natin no yung potential ng uh, market okay so if you want to trade naman uh, for ano for uh, uh, ADA no it might uh, it might retest dito Okay, it might retest that one. So that would be a buying opportunity, okay, sa market. So pagkatapos it will continue again upside. Okay, for uh, ADA. And the bad thing naman or the bearish uh, scenario for ADA. Okay, same with XMR to eh. Halos lahat ng mga markets, no? So same scenario for XMR. Okay. Kailangan it should at least, no? Uh, ito kasi yung retest area natin, yung retest area. And ano siya uh, Very critical yan So probably market will have a retest mamaya dito Okay or even this support no Pwede siya dyan We are facing this resistance ngayon Okay meron tayong resistance dito Ayan no Ayan meron tayong resistance there Okay meron tayong resistance area sa ano Sa Kayada Okay So nga kaya for ADA naman kung gusto mo pumasok kay ADA sir uh, ano uh, sir Ryan no okay it might re retest this one bago siya mag-continue right okay so yan yung possible na mangyari so uh, if our count maging ano siya eh maging 1 2 okay we have uh, a 3 and a 4 there so probably may mar meron tong flat correction no If it creates siya ng uh, drop there That would be a flat correction Sa market Okay Kasi initial market natin I count no Ng ating market dito is 1, 2, 3, 4 And a 5 Okay So if the price will break again uh, The previous high Diyan tayo papasok no Okay So uh, for our plan for ADA If uh, it will be a continuation If mag create pa siya another break out there Okay, and then uh, pwede natin pasukin yan Low risk na yan, no? every time na may breakout Low risk yan, so always remember 
breakout, good reward, okay? Maliit lang yung risk, okay, pag breakout. So kaya abang-abang kayo dito, just draw a trend line or a rectangle there uh, para makita mo yung breakout area. Pag hindi naman tayo bigyan, so dito tayo papasok oh, sa retest. Dito tayo papasok, probably A B C to eh. Pwede A B C yan, okay? Basta hindi siya lalagpas dito sa ating uh, previous high, probably pwede siya mag-create ng uh, flat correction with that uh, market no? kasi wave 4 tayo dito wave 4 okay retest tayo abang-abang tayo kay retest sa si ADA pag hindi naman siya mag-retest so we will entry during breakout right okay yan yung plano natin for ADA mataas yung ta target natin initially we'll have uh, first target is around this area okay probably around middle channel na middle channel uh, 1.59 ilan yung percentage na yan if i-break niya yan 10% maximum around 20% okay maganda kasi dito if uh, i-continue to sa taas eh yung target natin mga 26 first target sa around 10% and then another uh, 16% no that will be 26% right pwede okay good reward yan good reward okay trading is about risk reward talaga no okay um Wag, wag pilitin talaga pag walang pattern walang magandang entry wag pilitin okay para at least no safe tayo okay that's all for ADA abang abang tayo for ADA no uh, it is uh, added on my watch list okay isa rin to sa mga consideration ko for ADA okay um, T-Fuel okay T-Fuel tayo T-Fuel wala grabe ang lakas ng coin na to eh same with FTM no Ito yung mga grabe. Okay, grabe talaga tong mga coin na to. And uh, we will try to ano check the ano the status of the coin. ST fuel, T fuel, meron T fuel it. Wala akong T fuel, nako. Sayang, wala akong T fuel but add natin, okay? Add natin. Okay, buy nan BC project pala to. Meron ba ka T fuel? TLM Ah, yo Ayun, okay na Kanina, ayaw eh Ano ba yun? Ayun, ayun <laughs> Nako, delete natin to Ah, uh, delete time frame Ayun, grabe Ito, ito na yung sinabi ko <laughs> Grabe Ang lakas pala nito, no? Hindi ko nakita yung coin na to eh. lakas. Grabe. Nag-create po ng another swing dito. Nag-drop siya dito. Biglang pullback, no? Ito yung may drop eh. Grabe. Yung lakas. Swerte yung nakahold dito. No? Nung naipit ba? Swerte yung nakahold dito. Tapos naipit. During that market crash. Tapos nag-hold ka. Bumalik yung price. Nag-ano pa? Nag- uh, uh, Malakas pa yung taking profit mo dito. Grabe talaga tong coin na to eh. Okay, trend line wise. Okay, trend line tayo. Ayan, trend line tayo dyan. Trend line. Okay, resistance. And then, uh, count natin. Okay, count natin guys. no. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Extended wave 5 yan. Extended wave 5. Mhm. Oh, extended wave 5 'yan tapos at uh, um okay, even though bullish siya but meron talaga yang ano eh, meron talaga yang uh, another ano eh, another 1 2 3 4 5. Meron ba to? Tingnan natin, no. Kasi meron siya nang bumubuo dito ng wave 1 eh. Pwede pala to, one more leg up. Oh, check natin yung check natin yung levels, no. Uh, if invalid na ba? Nako, ang ganda pala ito ng wave 5 dito So dito yung wave 5 natin Meron tayong sub wave
minor this will be our this will be our intermediate eh. the macro no okay potential pwede di ba 1 2 3 4 5 wave 2 1 2 3 4 wave 4 natin maganda yung wave 4 natin no kasi if you try to measure that one that is uh, 3 ito yan eh 3 ito yun 3 ito yung uh, pump nyo back up back up agad no grabe ang ganda ng market ito eh Okay, targets natin for the wave 5 Macro wave 5 Meron pa tong one more leg up, no? Okay, ganda ng market it if you will okay, Meron pa tong one more leg up Hindi pa to, ano, hindi pa to uh, Beer market kay, ano, kay it if you will, no? Our targets for our wave 5 uh, Dito kasi, ano to, eh um, Extended, okay, extended wave 5 natin Grabe, ang taas Grabe, ang taas, no? Pwede, oh, pwede. Initially, that would be... Mm, okay. Okay, warning. Okay, warning tayo dito. Okay. We already hit the 1.618 natin. Oh, ang ganda, oh. 1.618 for the wave 5. Probably pwede. Pwede na ito dito, eh. Pwede na yan. Okay, pwede na yan, eh. Uh, okay. So, tingnan natin, oh. Sa market cycle ni, ano, ni uh, T-Fuel. Okay, so uh, the structure for our time frame natin, for our time frame. Okay, uh, one, two, five there, five. Okay. Mm hmm. Ito. Next target for wave 5 is 2.618 Pwede yan Ang taas na no? Grabe extended yung wave 5 natin eh Okay grabe extended yung wave 5 natin Okay check natin yung 5 o dito Okay pa naman siya If you try to check that one Shallow Okay, uh, one daily time frame natin, no? Okay, analyze talaga natin para atis makuha natin yung, ano, eh, yung uh, market structure, no? Kulang pa nga, eh, no? Okay, so, um, analyze natin, no? <laughs> Medyo, ano tayo dito, na... Okay, we have we have that uh, support here. Meron tayong support last drop niya ngayon. Okay, support area. Okay, levels to watch naman, okay for uh, for this market, okay. Mm -hmm. Impulsive yung ginawa niya dito eh. Loko talaga tong coin na to, no. Impulsive yung ginawa niya. Uh itong yung weak candle sika dito eh. Ayun no. Uh, okay So, hindi siya Hindi For the wave 3, wave 5 Potential wave 5, ano? Okay, uh, wave 5, right? Okay, uh, trend line Ayan Support area Okay So, uh, I want to see, ano? I want to see, uh, TF you will, no? Holding this, uh Trade, I mean, trade in the middle of the 0 0.5 trade to, and we could potentially see around this area 6185. Oh. So, ang mayari dito for uh, this market, okay, it could have at least swing, no, probably A, B, and a C. Okay, initially, that would be our count, no, uh, sa market ngayon for uh, for T fuel, okay, uh, possibly meron siyang swing dito. Kasi daily natin na uh, nagbaba dyan ng uh, swing dito eh. Yung ating daily time frame. Okay, 4 hours time frame naman natin. Mahina lang yung galaw niya. Okay, mahina. We will trap that one, the bear trend. Okay, bear trend lang. Bear trend wise. Okay. Kasi sa ngayon, nakita ko kay, ano, nakita ko kay, um, 
Ah, uh, dito, di TV well, no. Okay, there might be, no, there might be one more uh, leg up for for wave 5, right? Kasi hindi pa tapos yung cycle eh. Bitin pa talaga yung uh, yung cycle nito. Okay? Bitin pa. So we have a 1 2 3 4 and a 5. So itong 5 natin medyo bitin yan. Okay, it could go up there, pwede. So pag mangyari mag ano siya, mag uh, mag create siya ng uh, one more leg up dito for for T fuel for the final uh, move sa taas no. Kasi very be, uh, bullish talaga yung market eh. Imagine now ito yung mania. From that May, the bearish uh, major bre uh, breakdown ng ating market. Okay, nag-create siya ng magandang swing dito eh. Katapos ng retrace, right? So ngayon, what we are trying to check, no? Um, yung targets ng wave 5 natin, okay? Ito yung maganda na target natin eh for the wave 5. Ayan, no? Okay, it could go around. Pwede siya sa ito, pwede siya dito, alright? mga 1.272 uh, pwede right pwede siya okay and then um the structure that i am going to look at no for this market kay if you will is yung levels na inaabangan natin for the wave dito kasi pwede natin yang i-determine eh. pwede natin to makita masabi na this might be our uh itong uh, scenario dito eh. pwede to dito ayan Right, pwede, di ba? So, 1, 2, 3, 4, and a 5 Okay, hindi pa tapos A, B, and a C Okay, probably dito And then, potential swing na naman tayo uh, Dito, pwede natin consider to as si, ano to eh Si uh, truncated fifth dito Right there, truncated fifth, pwede dito Okay So, uh, we'll see na, we'll see what will happen uh, for this market, no? Okay, um, you know, 5, 3, 5, uh, 1, 3, 4, right? And then, uh, yung level siya dito for this market is around 3, 2, right? Maganda. And then, swing dito sa ating market, and then, breakdown. So, if gusto nyo i-long to, okay, kung gusto nyo mag-long, okay, kailangan i-break nyo mo itong bear trend, okay? Bear trend lang muna, okay? We'll wait for the breakout, kasi ito yung mga levels na inabangan natin, no? Okay, for uh, TF you will, right? So, in case na mag-breakdown naman, if uh, gusto nyo i-trade sa bearish side, uh, kasi mahina naman yung market ni, ano naman, ni, uh, ni TF you will. So, 1 hour tayo papasok, no? Ang hina ng market ni TF you will, eh. Okay? So, trend line. Okay, trend line lang. Okay, very basic, no? Just use trend line. Ayan, trend line lang. So, if the price of TFU will, will break this one, I will have my trade for TFU will. Okay? Targeting around... Medyo mataas yung target nandito dito eh. So, sabi no? That be around, ano to eh, mga 30%. Okay, mga 30%. Okay, mga 30%. These are, ano, ito yung resistance area natin din dito. First target here. Okay, first target is around mga 20% or 18% no? 18 to 20% next will be around 30% okay not bad diba so kaya if you want to trade uh, if you will just uh, wait for the breakout I'll add this on, um, on my watch list no breakout area din to eh pag gusto nyo kung gusto naman to i ano i, I uh, itong sell natin dito is uh, itong bearish no kung saan niya ano kung saan niya i-break Diyan tayo It's either itong uh, lower uh, trend line natin Or itong bear trend natin Yung babasagin niya Okay So um, Waiting pa rin tayo Okay waiting pa rin Medyo Yan yung ano eh Okay Yan yung uh, status ni ano eh Ni uh, T-Fuel It's either breakout niya yan Or i-breakdown niya Okay Waiting pa rin tayo for T-Fuel Okay next Next tayo for Um Medyo natagalan tayo, no? Andyan pa ba kayo, guys? Okay, andyan pa ba kayo? Okay, uh, AXS tayo. AXS. Sir Irish. Ar uh, Albert, no? Andyan pa ba kayo? AXS. Okay, AXS. Naka, ano tayo? Nakatapos sa na tayo dun, eh. Pati yung bake, oh. Breakout yung bake, oh. Grabe, lakas ng mga, ano, yung mga alcoins, no? Si Bake, si... Uh... Hindi pa 
masyado yung ibang alphabet si Cichar oh tumas Cichar daming breakout oh pati Digo okay 3, 4, 5 yes spot lang spot lang ano Sir Ryan I don't know if merong ano I don't know if merong leverage token si T-Fuel meron ba yung uh, uh, T-Fuel down okay pwede, pwede natin yan i-trade eh to uh Okay, for AXS, okay, tapos na yung cycle, okay, um, alert, alert, okay, spoiler alert for AXS, ano ba yun, ano ba yung spoiler alert, okay, super extended na, oh, extended na masyado, imagine, oh, 200% yung pump niya, kaya, um, if you want to trade this one, ako, mahirap to. Okay, uh, FOMO na yan Pagpapasok ngayon eh Grabe yan taas ng, Ang taas ng extension na no? Ang taas ng extension eh Hindi masyado to Ang ganda uh, So posible ito eh Okay Okay, meron pa tayong one more leg up Pero retracement lang muna Pahinga lang muna guys Okay, pahinga lang Okay, huwag masyadong ano Okay Okay, huwag masyado ano Huwag masyado greedy no Retracement na inabangan natin Around Okay, 3A2 Okay, watch out kayo dito kung gusto nyo bilhin to. Target sa round ito. Okay, target natin. So, yan yung uh, excess update natin, no? Wait nyo lang tong retracement. Okay, it's either mag-create siya ng uh, ABC structure, zigzag, or triangle, no? For the continuation pattern. Kasi meron pa tayong one more leg up dito. One more leg up. Para another cycle ng ano, correction Okay Last will be SFP SFP no uh, SLP pala SLP Okay SLP natin Ang ganda no uh, We have Meron tayong TA nito before eh Meron tayong TA nito Okay breakout na to Okay break, breakout of the major bear trend Okay paano ba i-trade to Okay maganda rin yung structure nito eh Okay Ang ganda, di ba? Ang ganda. Okay, check natin, check natin, check natin. Para uh, maganda yung pasok natin. Okay, a retracement to watch. Okay, take note, no? Take note sa mga nagtitrade ngayon. A retracement to watch for SLP. Same with uh, same with AXS. Okay, sa round ito. Support area Meron tayong mga support area dyan Dalawa Okay One And two Okay Para kung gusto nyo yung continuation pattern Okay Dapat i-hold nyo yan Okay Or else Okay um, Kasi bitin pa to eh Bitin pa masyado no Bitin pa Ayun, na-hit na pala ito. Pero bitin pa yung subwave niya eh. Okay, A, B. C. 1, 2, 3, 4. Ah, okay, okay. Tama. Tama pala. Okay, tama. Okay, tama pala. Tama pala ito. For SLP, target natin for retracement. Okay, I'll be finishing my count. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 1 more leg up there. Okay, 1 more leg up. Target for the 1 more leg up is around... Ito yung, ito yung target natin. Ayan. Ayan. Okay And then retracement Pagkatapos uh, Saan ba yung 5 natin no? Ang layo naman Ang layo <laughs> Okay Ang layo naman no? 
Okay, pwede siya ma-extend, pwede. Pwede siya ma-extend. Okay, we'll, we'll see, no? Hanggang saan yung uh, extension nito. Kasi pwede siya dito, guys. So, pwede siya dito. Ayan. Wave 5 natin, pwede. Di ba? Kasi meron tayong diagonal. And then, one more leg up here. Okay, pwede. Meron pa tayong one more, uh, one more pop, no? Mga around, mga another 141%. For SLP, right? Meron pa tayong 141%. So, um, if you want to buy SLP, kasi ano, alam naman natin, we are uh, we are outside of the beer trend. So, okay, wait nyo tong area na to. Okay, ilan ba yung percentage ng drop niya? Mga around sa 6% or 7%. So, it should create a pattern. Uh, kailangan, uh, kahit ano lang, kahit triangle, no? Kahit triangle. And then, bago siya tataas ulit. Okay, para at least makapagbigay, uh, makapagbigay siya ng another uh, chance no, sa mga hindi pa nakapasok okay? so waiting tayo for SLP okay? uh, corrective pattern lang triangle much better wait lang okay? wait lang tayo yan yung patience is the key right? okay, tapos na tayo dyan safe pal okay, safe pal tayo okay, so last will be the Not the list, no? SFP, SSS SFP, ito Munda to, SFP Ladies and gentlemen Okay, breakout area, malapit ito Okay, uh, wait to to guys no? Mag-breakout yan, ayan, okay um, Short term Beer trend, ito, ito yung beer trend Natin, short term beer trend, right And then, pag yan Mag-break, nako, I'll trade that one Okay, I'll trade that one uh, For the major beer trend the month For SFP First bear trend is this one. Ayan. Ayan yung first bear trend natin, right? Second bear trend. Okay, ang dami kasing bear trend dito. Ito, second bear trend. Ayan. So, medyo marami yung uh, kailangan niya i-break, no? Okay. Uh, Pattern-wise. Okay, first. First bear trend na babasagin niya. Itong short-term bear trend niya. Ito. Right? It should break that one. So, probably, pag mag-break siya, Retest and then break Retest and then upside o, Yan yung possible na mangyari sa pattern Kaya no, kaya SFP Okay, so if I will trade Okay, I'll add this on my watch list Okay, meron tong future, no? meron tong future si ano eh Si uh, ano, Si um, Si SFP, right? Okay, meron tong future So, okay, wala tayong lower high dito So, create ng lower low talaga to Pure lower low So, ngayon I'll be expecting na in case basagi niya to so this will be very impulsive right okay so kaya if you want to trade ESFP okay wait nyo to i-break right okay for the bear trend naman okay so ating count sa ating bear trend yung ABC ABC okay and then um, okay we are trying WXY Grabe talaga yung drop niya dito eh. Invalid yung bull cycle niya eh. Ang ABC, ABC siya dito eh. Tapos ABC din dito. Right there. Okay. So probably that will be uh, uh, W, X, Y, X, Z. Okay. W, X, Y, X, Z. Parang gano'n yung structure niya Kasi meron siyang ABC, 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 ABC Okay, patapos ABC Okay, yun yung uh, ginawa niya ABC Okay, and then uh, Hindi pala, hindi pala um, ABC, ABC okay. So yan um, For this market, no WXO yung ginawa niya Okay, meron tayong uh, ABC dito, right? And then nag EBC pa siya dito, right? So ngayon, for the current price ni ano ni SFP, as what I have mentioned kanina, I will let the market break muna dito, right? Okay, break niya muna 'yan. Much better. One hour natin still, no? We are still on the upside naman. Uh, I mean sa 4 hours. And one hour naman natin, meron siyang uh, pataas na cross, no? And then uh, we are waiting for this one. Nako, ang ganda to. I will start to trade no I'll be having my um uh, my ano na dito uh, initial buy okay initial buy 
if in case na i-break niya tong ating resistance area. If the price will start to break or move above there, okay, if there will be a, a market, I mean the, the candlestick, no? If it will move above, I will buy, uh, I mean, I will put my long position for SFP. Okay? And then, waiting tayo for the breakout na naman. Dalawa yung breakout area dito, eh, for uh, SFP. Okay? First, is around, ano to, eh, mga 0 0.74 Next will be around 0.76 Yung breakout point niya Okay, abang-abang kayo dito For bearish naman, no? uh, short term bearish niya If we break niya itong trend line natin Okay, short term bearish na yan If the price will create another break dito or breakdown We might retest the low Okay, or the, the, the support here Pwede, okay, pwede yan So, it should, it should at least hold, no? Itong trend line natin for... Uh, SFP Okay, para at least uh, Makapagkaroon uh, tayo ng breakout no? So, abang-abang kayo dito for SFP Okay, breakout area Breakout wise tayo para sigurista Okay, sigurista tayo eh Yan yung Pinoy, no? Pinoy mindset Sigurista tayo Huwag yung uh, trade lang na nakita natin Nag-uptrend, huwag Okay Based on our plan, break niya muna to Tapos, uh, we are reaching the resistances 1%, uh, 2% Okay, waiting, malit na lang eh Just wait, no? 2% na kasi yung pang possible na kailangan natin eh. Pero before the breakout, no? Before that breakout, 2% na lang. Okay? Kaya we, waiting lang tayo. Patience is the key. Okay? So that's all for tonight. Okay? Thank you for tuning in sa mga uh, tumatangkilik sa ating uh, YouTube channel. Okay? So don't forget to subscribe, guys, no? And um, to support our channel. Okay? Just subscribe. Invite your friends and let them subscribe also. And then click that notification bell para updated sila sa ating uh, live market update. Okay? So, yan. Yan yung status natin. So, we are waiting for that breakout area. Right? Okay? So, uh, yan. Tapos na tayo. Ang taas, no? <laughs> Ang taas ng ating uh, uh, discussion. Okay? <laughs> And congratulations everyone. No? Okay? Nakuha natin yung mga analysis, no? Especially, uh, uh, kay BTC and, um, meron tayong mga gandang mga, ano, eh, mga opportunities sa market. Okay, dogcoin natin, okay? Watch out nyo talaga si dogcoin mamaya, no? Okay, sa mga, ano naman, sa mga, uh, community members natin, watch out nyo si dog. We have also, uh, meron tayong inabangan dito, eh, si XMR, okay? Andun din si XMR, no? Okay, XMR natin yung kanina. Same with Alpha. T-Fuel Okay, breakout structure Kay T-Fuel We have SFP Breakout structure then Dogcoin Okay, breakout structure Okay, uh, Alice Wala, waiting pa tayo kay Alice Vet Okay, vet natin guys Okay, nako Okay uh, Alarming, no? <laughs> si vet natin guys Okay um, Meron siya extension na triangle dito Supposedly, dapat dito to eh Right? Pero nag-create pa siya ng another, no? Another uh, range, no? Another range Ito na yung uh, another range ni ano ni Vet. Kaya abang-abang kayo no, everyone. For Vet, okay, wait nyo tong breakout area niya. Okay, wait natin. So, yan, marami tayong inabangan ngayon no. Especially si Vet, Dog, okay? And uh, we have uh, SFP. Okay, mga breakout area. Okay, so that's all. Okay, that's all. So, uh, yan, thank you, thank you everyone. Thank you. And then um, hopefully no uh, before kayo mag-trade as always trade with the uh, confirmation no wag kayong mag-trade pag walang confirmation okay So uh, kailangan nakaplano lahat okay set aside yung FOMO set aside yung emotional trader no or uh, yung being an emotional trader So kailangan uh, you, you must be confident enough no sa pag-trade nyo Wag kayong matakot kasi pag mayroon kang stop loss okay lang right risk management Wag kayong ano, wag kayong all in guys, do not increase your position size. Right? Okay? Uh, kasi pag matalo ka, mahirap yan i-recover, no? So pag nakapag-risk management ka, matalo ka man, pwede mo siya i-recover agad-agad. Okay, yan yung advantage, no? Uh, if you want to be uh, longer I mean a uh, long uh, long perspective, no? And uh, macro perspective, right? Macro perspective. So pag uh, macro perspective kayo, So you want to um, to be one of the traders who succeed, no? Uh, from this time up to five years, ano? 
uh, after five years parang ganun so even though lalagpas na yung five years and andito pa rin tayo no to trade pa right uh, unlike yung iba the, the increase the position size na liquidate lahat so mahirap pero okay lang yan kasi ano siya eh, part of the learning process okay so yan so you should at least no study risk management and then uh, yan trade your plan and Uh, breakout area must be much better no? risk reward and everything okay that's all for tonight god bless everyone good night and good luck sa mga trades you know abang abang kayo sa signal natin sa VIP signals and also free signals sa ating discord channel sa mga wala pa do doon sa ating discord channel okay um, follow me on the facebook no just uh, search silent dash trader no andun tayo and then uh, join kayo sa ating ano sa ating discord kasi marami tayo yung free learning doon I am sharing my technical analysis using Elliott Wave. Nagbibigay din tayo ng signals, okay? So that's all. God bless and good night. Thank you, thank you.